We went from me paying actual things to me paying nothing because it's hypothetical stuff that cannot happen. It's unless I went to a convention and I mean, if that was gonna happen, it, yeah. I, or, it I'd have to be sober. Yeah, of course. All right, we made it. All right, I, I started the stopwatch. Do it. All right, all right. Oh, I forgot. Who's gonna introduce this part? I'm introduced. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna introduce it right now. Yeah. Welcome back to Catherine Full Body. We're about to leave the bar. It's closing time. They want us to get out. Um, there's a license plate there. Yeah. Is that Ohio? Is that what it says? Uh oh. No, it's just a Utah. I see. I can't tell. It's too. You see, I thought it was Ohio at first because the colors kind of remind me of Ohio, but I think this is Utah. I gotta be honest, I am nearsighted, so yeah. my glasses it's are kinda, not helping with this. It's kind of blurry, unfortunately. Yeah, uh, the resolution is just not great enough. My point is, uh, as you said, Chaz, welcome back to Catherine. It's me, Gildum. I never introduce it like I usually do, but that's fine. We're here. Yeah, we gotta leave the bar. They want us out. We've been lingering no, too no, long. No, they don't want us out. We can still just loiter, just but, jobs. you know. I don't have any cash. Um, I can't. <laughs> money. Oh, you oh! said it! You said it! You said it! I knew we uh, had to. Time. It always happens. We get it ready for the part, and then it happens right at the beginning of the next part. Yep. All right, I got it ready. Time for a shot. I already did it. I don't know what Chaz is is shooting, but mine is smooth that I just do it while he concludes his thoughts. I uh, I was hot. Hey, are you going home? Oh man, are you going home? Oh, she said it. Yeah. Should should I say I have stuff to do or not yet? You have stuff to do. Okay. All right. I have something to do. To be well, fair, I already got I all the dialogue from Catherine, own. so there's nothing left for me to really just ponder and try to pry out of her. All of her voice dialogue was grayed out. She's gonna barge into your room anyway. Well, I mean, look at me. I'm just sipping a beer on my bed with is my skibbies on. My mother's been calling which is not is that, that accurate from what I would do in my real life because it's pretty cold. I I actually have to wear pajamas. What did you think of my like, I'm a big boy, I admit. And I have, like, I have thick fat to, like, insulate my own temperature, but... It's still the Northwest, so it's cold. It's still kind of hot here. Only because I'm on the second floor. Oh. I'm on the second floor, but I got my window open. That's probably the big difference, uh, though. That is the big difference. Mine's not open. I, I like Nightmare. I like my temperature's a little cold. It gets way Thumb too lock. warm. Thumblock. Who are these people? Uh, I think these are actual people. Well, they suck. You suck, Thumblock. <laughs> no, Thumblock is my favorite. Yo, Thumblock, come over to my apartment. I'll give you a nice beer. I How's wonder that? if I have to censor all that. Like, when you said his name, I gotta beep it out, and then I gotta, like... I don't even know if I said it. <laughs> you probably <laughs> didn't. But my point is, I think <laughs> I got to, just to make sure. So why are they even in here? You, you can, you can, we can, we can pretend that Chaz yeah. dropped a, a very suggestive <laughs> word, a very, um, very, very, like he actually oh. swore, even though Chaz never swears. Oh man, look at this! I know, right? Wait, is this what song is it playing now? I don't. I don't. Know. I don't remember. But we got we got the blocks that are like spikes, so you can't you can't. Oh yeah, remember those. Make sure that dance dies. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, they're not gonna. They're gonna get stuck over there though. But my point is, um, I gotta be careful with these. I can't stop on them because, 
Uh, yeah. I, I die if I do, right? You'll turn into sheep juice. <laughs> oh! That was uh, it actually stopped for a second. I was like, wait a second. Whoa. But the the real fortunate thing is I can actually do the dingle method. Alright, I got it. Wait a minute, what? I'm using the dingle method. Oh. Remember, I told you, I told, I told you about I, this. I'm confused because you were standing on that choppy block a while. Oh, look, a white block. I turned into sheet juice. You did. But this is easy mode, so it's baby mode. I can, I can just make a lot of the easy mistakes like so. Perfect for people who have been drinking on that. <laughs> it is perfect for full body drunk yards like myself. I am really wondering about my life choices right now, but the question is, should I really? Can't we yes. all just get along? Can't no. I just can't I just make some contacts with friendos? No. Yeah, you're right. Actually you're my friendo. So what the, Chaz, what the, I have what? I have a very questionable question for you. Questionable, huh? Okay. And it's uh, from the movie. Which movie? There will be blood. Uh, do I drink your milkshake? No, actually that's a Oh, you gotta do the tornado method. Actually, no, I take it back. It's not from There Will Be Blood. I'm thinking of that S... S Wait, how do you break those again? What? How do you break the choppy things? What choppy things? Like, you know how it's like going up? How did you break it? What? I got it. The spikes, they're going... They're not going... One of them wasn't going up anymore. I saw a break. Magic? I thought there's a. I don't quite break. understand what you're getting at. Uh, oh, Hold on. I am more aware of what the game wants me to do. Um, I don't know, but I did it. You made it. I made it. I apologize if I don't quite understand your question, Chaz. Well, when the spikes go up, isn't there a way to like break it so they stop? Being stupid like that? Uh, no. You just gotta activate them and then slide over so you don't get impaled by them. Oh, uh, see, I thought there was a way to stop them. No, well, I mean, I guess you can turn them normal, but that's the bell item. Uh, so I don't, I don't, I thought there was a way, like. Falling? No. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. Yeah, I guess it doesn't. Point is, I escaped. I lived to see another day, except if this was real life, I would be impelled, or dumb, or, you know, I'd be like the drunken god Dionysus. You were, but you were, I mean, Vincent was already kind of drunk, so. I was walking out. Oh my god, what the Whoa, fuck is here. this shit? Whoa. I love it. What are you doing here? You shouldn't be what here. You doing here? Oh, hi, hey, Vincent. Vincent. I'm not sure what's, going, sure what's on. going on. I found this piano, so I just. Bryn, you it. are best girl. What are you doing here? Is that your underwear? I gotta be honest. Um, like she's best girl, not like in a romantic sense. Just like she? if I had what a best mean? friend and she was a female variety, it'd mean, be Bryn. Because, I mean, you don't always need to have a love interest. Sometimes, sometimes, people are just people, and friends are just friends. You can have a platonic relationship. She's gonna play a song. I gotta be honest, I like Rin. She's like, if I had a daughter and it was Rin, it'd be best daughter ever. She's playing a song for everybody. How Best daughter ever! I wanna know what the song is. It's based on a real song I don't recognize. That's right. I heard it earlier, and then. And then the ground stopped crumbling. Was you might. 
Or you might not, and you'd be like, I'm curious, and you'll look it up, and you'll be like, hey, that's a good song. So I'm gonna go look it up. She's gone. She died. She didn't die, she just disappeared. Can you play her piano? I still. I still got still go with my theory she's an angel she if I didn't is. just if I didn't go into my theory I believe Rin is an angel because Catherine is a demon so why wouldn't they mix in those angelical bodies because when you play SMT you have angelical you have angelical demons that you can summon and they're based on the Judeo-Christian mythology. I mean, for crying out loud, you can summon Michael the Archangel, and let me tell you, I played Persona 3. The main protagonist actually does sometimes shout out the main, per the main, the persona that you have equipped, and it was weird. One night, it was late at night. I was just like playing Persona 3, and all of a sudden, the main character just shouted out Michael and I was like what the <laughs> fuck is going on the game apparently is trying to communicate with me but no it was just it was just because I had Michael equipped and he just happened to say that persona's name it's a rant it is kind of random but I mean he does do it and all of a sudden he summoned Michael the Archangel because I had it it was late in the game because obviously Michael is one of the Archangels, and it is the same in the Persona game, so yeah, it was just like, Persona 3 main character shouting out Michael, I was like, what the fuck is going on? But no, that's well, just, that's just the cards that were dealt to me. At least he says Michael, right? He says Kakalin wrong. I mean, we're talking about Persona 3 protagonists. Well, I don't know what he says, but Joker says Kakalin wrong. Oh, well, my point is... Actually, you can... I'm positive you can get Michael in Persona 5. You know, I think you can too, but I can get that. I'm, I'm positive you fight it. Have you seen them? I gotta be honest, I would love to do a Persona playthrough, or any sort of Shin Megami Tensei playthrough. But my problem is, it's a hard game unless you grind. And, uh, I don't know, my point is, like, I can grind like there's no tomorrow. It's like, it's like if I was gonna do a Pokemon playthrough, I could grind and I'd be like, it's no challenge whatsoever. But then I'd be like that one random trainer that is like, I am not Whitney, I'm the male version of Whitney, except instead of being naturally talented, I am drunk all the time. Except, alcohol doesn't exist in the Pokemon universe. I am, I am on juice all the time. Because that's what Harvest Moon does. That's how Harvest Moon censored alcohol. I, I would be a juiced up trainer on juice. Chaz, what do you have to say about that? It's do the same thing. I I want to do a let's play of Harvest Moon. Well, finish this one. For you're you're right, Chaz. I need to finish up for some. Chaz, I can't. You know, the saddest thing is, I can't include you in a playthrough of Harvest Moon. Because it's such... It's like it's like if I was to bring you in on Stardew Valley. Where, honestly, the best I can ever hope for is our podcast parts. Yeah. And I mean, those are great. I love our podcast, but the problem is, that's the best I can do when going through Harvest Moon. Uh, if I wanted to do Harvest Moon, I guess I could do Rune Factory, but I really don't want to tackle on emulation, so my only two options... You gotta do the new Harvest Moon. It's terrible, that one. Well, but... I was gonna say, so yeah, 
uh, see, what is it, like, the season, uh, Story of Seasons. Story of Seasons. So, that's actually Harvest Moon-esque. Oh. It's made by the... It's made developers. by the Harvest Moon people. Yeah. <laughs> that's actually what happened to Harvest Moon. Um, it, it did the whole, uh, Dragon Quest thing. Well, what does the sheep's gotta say? Cause we've Which been here sheep? For like 20 minutes. Any of them, I don't care. I she think I think I went through all the base. Oh, I I forgot the sheep. Why is there a piano? Why is a piano here? Here? She's but talking about Rin, when he was a sheep. who is the sweetest well, chick ever. <laughs> I like Rin. <laughs> I don't I I don't want to I don't want to bed Rin. Okay, I like her. I like her plutonically. All right. Honestly, I'm still I'm still in. I get. Sorry, I had to sigh in, in sadness because <laughs> you know what's up, Chess. <laughs> so there's obviously the ending where you get to end up with Rin romantically, and I, she's so sweet. I don't want to. I don't want to end up with Rin. Vincent doesn't deserve her. She, you know. I couldn't have said it better. Vincent doesn't deserve Rin. But obviously, there are going to be endings where Vincent ends up with Rin in a romantic sense. And I'm sure it's going to be one of those things where it's like, maybe Vincent becomes a better man for it. But you honestly, it's like he's it. been in a relationship with Catherine with a K. So isn't that the true, like, try to... You, this is this is the ending that all true warriors strive for and and no it's not but uh you what? you sheep with the sunglasses i remember oh, look at you him. were the I classmate oh! of vincent he said the f word i don't have a shot because we already did that at the beginning of this playthrough you don't even need it no just get me out of here <laughs> no uh that's red that's blue Hey Chaz, question: Red or blue? It, Darth Sidious. Red? Yeah. <laughs> it's impossible. <laughs> oh, I pissed him off. He's a VIP. Guys. I think he married into that. Oh yeah. Like, wasn't that the thing he worked hard and then he ended up marrying into, like, something that made him even bigger? And, and like, he had the option of, like, falling for a woman because he was in love. And then something happened. I don't know. Something about arranged marriage or something. Like, fuck you. <laughs> fuck you. You know what? At the end of the day, when it comes down to it, you should always follow your heart because you're going to be unhappy for the rest of your life. Fuck your whole, I'm going to screw my future. Oh my god. Alright, let's find out some more techniques. Hello. Okay, I like, I like yeah. your thought. Yeah, it was a nice ambient music. Why nice it was quite innovative. It's Truth. Yeah. I agree. I'll join you. <laughs> you know what? It doesn't beat my dangle technique. Your dangle technique wouldn't let you get past the bridge. You're right. It isn't. This actually helps the dangle technique because when it comes down to it, I. If you utilize the bridge with the dangle technique, you end up winning. You just gotta know which is more appropriate for the situation. Oh, the flying bridge. The hardest part about the flying bridge is you gotta be aware of when to slide a block. Okay, see this? You gotta be aware of when to slide a block to dangle on a, so it says a block. Edge. So it does edge, yeah. You gotta be aware of when to slide a block so it edges across 
the path. Then you can actually yeah. utilize the flying bridge. Yeah. Wow, I knew it. Wow, I knew it. You're not just a... You know, my dangle technique's not gonna amount to shit when I get to, like, the later levels. The uh, ice block. Do you want to review the techniques? I guess I'll, I'll join, join you. you. Sure. sure. First, here's a technique. Allow me to explain. We yeah. already saw it. We did. I don't know why it's pink, though. I don't care about your flying bridge. Yeah, I just, I, look, I already created my technique. It's called the dangle. I already created my technique, the sloppy Sunday. <laughs> the only problem is your sloppy Sunday isn't practical. Well, my uh, my dangle technique is practical. Whatever. I'll let you in on a technique. I I feel like I feel like you have potential. For the sloppy Sunday to actually be an extremely useful <laughs> technique in in like a last dish effort. <laughs> sloppy Sunday. It's I, I do. I feel like when you run, see, he oh, slot, no, fuck technique. you. It's called the dangle technique. Regent hair sheep. <laughs> fuck you. It's called dangle <laughs> technique. <laughs> He's going around me like, ooh, look at my spider! Look at this technique! I call it the dangle technique, because you dangle off the edges. Fuck you! Todd, you're the worst sheep ever! I was... I, I came up with the technique before you. That means it's the dangle technique. You have to comply with my demands. I read up the contract. I read up the ink. You sign your soul with blood. I am devil. They call me Lucy Monfer. What? Lucy Monfer. Lucy Monfer? What does that even mean? It means... I am Lucy Monfer. Now sign your blood. It's the dangle oh, technique. Talk about the technique. You mustn't let your guard down. He, he, that guy. he stole my technique. I'll see you in court. I'm gonna take you to that long hair. Look, we got long haired sheep. This, this must be Archie. No, it's Jonathan. It's Archie. 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 Kano, man. He said the hockey sticks were. Look, we got we got the best sheep. Mr. Pony Coin. Pony Coin. Might as well call him Pony Coin. It makes a Bible. I gotta be honest. Um, the Bible. Uh, okay. You know what? If we had sheep, that's cool. But the thing is, you can whap them with your pillow. The, the point is, the Bible's only good for later on in the yeah. game. Like, when we get to stage 5, maybe the Bible's good. Bell makes regular blocks, which if you only got heavy blocks, it's good. But I'll tell you what, my my white block is no. fine as it is. So he's gonna my assault me and call me a fro man. Uh, uh, excuse me. Please come again. <laughs> He's a merchant at the end of the day. I got a question. Remember how uh, everyone has an origin how they got cursed to this place? Yeah. How did fat merchant sheep get cursed to this place? He wouldn't pay his ladies of the night. He hired prostitutes. <laughs> one no, no, actually, going on that, I bet one of them got knocked up, had a kid, and he's like, you're gonna pay me child support. And this guy's like, I have all the money. Fuck you. <laughs> actually, that would be a legit story. What is this guy's story? Someone come up with a better story in the comments than what I just came up with. I want to hear it.
I don't we care what you fact. say, I don't care how ridiculous it is, in fact, the more ridiculous it is, the better. Someone just come up with the best story ever for Fat Merchant Sheet. Come on, he's in this place, as fucked up as it is, obviously this guy has to have quite the backstory. Especially if he's asking for coins for items. I mean, think about it, this guy collects all the items, and I mean, unlike, a, unlike us, he can carry how many items? Look at all oh, those items. Good. So clearly this guy has to be like Donald Trump of the sheep world. Ronald Rump. Yeah, yeah. Wooloo Rump. <laughs> Go to the confession. We gotta all right, say all right. Opinion. I'm going. I'm going. We got a Boston uh, fight, okay? Talk to the thing. I'm here. I'm here. Take, Take me, up. me up. I gotta Don't be honest. Me. I answered the last question, if I remember correctly, uh, at the confessional. Oh, the so answer. this is you. Oh yeah, let's do it. This is I didn't a surprise. Expect to so I didn't expect to have a visitor. So get ready, Chaz. What the hell is I'm ready. Going on? You, you know something, something about Rin, don't, don't you? Let's just say the tide, so the tide shifted. has shifted. Thanks to you, something unexpected. unexpected is taking place. Regardless, I'll continue to ask oh, questions. Oh, baby, here it comes. The third question. <laughs> Are you interested in deviant sexual, sexual activities? <laughs> oh man, so uh, so yeah. Do you have how, a huge libido? Do, how, you, do you want a lot of sex? Do you want no? Do you want an average amount of sex, or do you want like more sex? I want no sex. You want. So you want zero. you want asexuality. I want zero. And that was cool, Why you know that... Todd Todd made Why it. Why is that just... good? So Why is that a good thing? It's not good, it's it's more lawful. Think about it. Why is Actually, that I'll be honest, you ever watched Bojack Horseman? Todd was asexual. Isn't that show like all animals? It's it's human and animals, but at the same time, it's also not like furry esque. They're just basically extensions of um, anthropomorphic animals, but not in, like a furry sense. More in like a more realistic human esque sense. Yeah, sex is something. Well, most people want some kink in their life. Yeah, I wait. Why is pink no? Oh. Shouldn't it be a li shouldn't a little be pink and no be blue? I don't know. I don't think because you're matters. prude. I think guess you know sex stuff is it's all Each mysterious and stuff when you're young. I you're guess. Old. I just want to go to sleep and get eight hours. <laughs> you you know what? That reminds me of this one thing from this sitcom puppet show called Dinosaurs. Is that with the the dinosaur and the I'm the and... baby, God love me. Yeah, that one. Yeah, basically their new definition of marriage was uh Earl, the big the big dad dinosaur, just wanted yeah. to go to sleep and the mom Fran, she was like, I can comply with that because it was like the new definition of um, their current state in marriage. <laughs> it, it was like the most romantic thing ever, considering um, they di they didn't want sex; they just wanted to get sleep. But I, I mean, I feel like that's the true sign of a married couple, or just like a couple that's been together for a while, where it's like, yeah, you you don't need to actually spice it up. You just sometimes you just want to get some sleep. It's cool. I will BRB, so instant cut. Do I have to con- no, I'm not no, gonna- No, 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 I'm, I'm just gonna go potty. Go ahead. Alright, Chaz, my boy. Let's, Here. uh... Let's do... The second floor of the torture chamber. Man, oh man, let me tell you something. I'm not ready for the torture chamber. I'm always ready for torture. I, I'm not. Let me tell you something. When it comes to torture... Oh, I take it back. Guess who's talking to us? Is it Rin? It is Rin. Up here! The ground below is falling! Please be careful! 
I I'm having all sorts of weird bills serious? when it comes to Rin because I like her, not like in the most platonic sense. Mm. Apparently, She's when she plays slow piano, blocks. it slows down the falling blocks. Mm. I mean, narrator man said that, but whoa, that guy's dead. It is one of those things where it's like, well, that's a very interesting little tidbit you told me there. That was kind of funny. He died. He did die. She, it's sheepies. Sheepy made a sleepy. He's not gonna sleep anymore. He's dead. He's gonna he's gonna go to the eternal sleep. The big sleep. The big sleep. Dangle technique. I know, right? Man, the what was it? The slayer technique. Fuck you. The spider technique. The, the spi it's the sli It's the dangle technique. The patented from me, Gildum. A book. Me. Get the book. I got the book. It removes the enemies. It's the Bible. It's not the Bible. It's not the Bible. It just removes that's, enemies. That's high rule. <laughs> I've been playing the Breath of the Wild because they announced uh, what's it called, Breath of the Wild Two. Yeah. And I want I want to play it when it comes out, but I've never beaten. Breath of the Wild 1. Can you crush that sheep? Probably. But my thing is... Uh... I want to be able to actually... I want to be able to, like, you know, do this. And have fun and stuff. Dude, I and I want to play Breath of the Wild 2 when it comes out. So I don't have to, like, beat Breath of the Wild 1. Because... I would have got distracted and tried to kill him. I want to beat Breath of the Wild. I want to beat Breath of the Wild one. Mm -hmm. uh, Whoa! Also, I can't do that. Also, I can't. You know, I had a thought. I wanted to go on the spike thing, but the thing is, I can't do that because if I do that, I can screw the spikes. Cause I'll die. I'll die. Yeah. I'll die real hard. Die hard. That'll make me really, really sad. Um, hmm. I got an idea. A good idea. I have an idea too. It's a bad idea. No, it, my, mine's a great. What the? F that was not my idea. Are you having some trouble? Remember, you can always go back. And you could do that. I got, I got a different idea. What are you even doing? You had a perfectly legitimate idea. What? What? Trust me when I say this. I got, I got an idea. Okay. I don't trust that. What, I got, wait, I got an idea. It's a good idea. Okay. I'm trying to, get that one. I'm trying to use the dangle technique. Okay. Mm. It. I told you, it's a good idea. I realize you're trying to get the money. Uh, uh, yeah, okay. All right. I I agree. My idea was probably flawed in the sense that you may not have understood the end goal, but I wanted to use the dangle t technique to get the money because I want a high score. Because I can't. the hedgehog. It's easy, three. but I get I get the Trisha trophy. Guess who it is? It's Rin. Guess what happens if I talk to her? She goes away. You're right. Rin, you're okay. She makes an. She so does an upbeat piano theme. What the hell is going on with you and that piano? Hey, quit the chit chat and keep playing. I don't care if you suck at it. I'm scared of that. <laughs> <laughs> she sucks. Listen, Actually, it sounds good. The only one whose life is at stake here. That piano saved me earlier. Saved him. Don't worry, I won't stop playing it. Sorry, I guess we'll. Have I gotta to be honest. Play. I think Rin is an angel. Is she your angel? No. Uh, I don't know. Here's the thing. I think Rin is amazing, but the thing is, if I, if Rin was my angel, I don't know if that relationship would get boring. 
No, not like your wife, folks. But like your little angel. Like guardian angel? Yeah. Uh, oh, in that case, I think she would be the right amount of stuff to make me happy. If I had a guardian angel, that would be an interesting story. I feel like it could make it for a good Hallmark movie. Um... Hey, the gold sheep's here again. The gold sheep... Where? That's not the gold sheep. Is that the gold sheep? Is that that's the one that's gonna buy me an oil field? Let me tell you, viewers. In the next part, I'm gonna talk to gold sheep and he's gonna say something absurd like, I'll get you two oil fields. Single soldier field. I'll get you a copy of Metal Gear Solid. I Nine. have Metal Gear Solid. All of them. You're right, I need to go to Amazon right now. No! <laughs> Amazon, look, get me in the collection. Broke. You're gonna be broke by the time this game's Black over. Black Friday. It's not Friday anymore. Black Friday. It's still Friday. Oh no, it's 1am. It's 10.08.